am back with another quick video this one's gonna be a quick one because i'm starving i've been fat sausage and cabbage and it was beautiful um but i'm gonna veganize it and show you how i veganize it and it's so quick it's so easy and it's so tasty for me you know what i mean but these are a few of the things i've got here i'll just show you i've got some um vegan sausages i'm only going to use one or two of these because these ones seem to be quite crispy but not as depth in that porky flavor these have that porky flavor these are hot dogs um not sausages so i'm going to use one of these and i've got some no bull vegan burgers so yeah i'm going to um dive straight into this and show y'all how i do what i do <clears throat> okay is back i got my board ready I'm literally going to take one of these burgers out. They're still frozen. So I'm going to chop it in two. Look at that. It looks like. Okay, friends, at this point, all I've done is chopped up two of the burgers, two of the hot dog sausages, and two of the regular sausages. You haven't got to use that much. I've used that much because of the size of my family. So use according to whatever you want to use. And you don't have to use all three. Um, I'd say just, just using the hot dog sausages is fine, especially if you're cooking for yourself or you're just cooking for two or three people, then that should be absolutely fine. Then I'm going to add all of this to a pan with some thyme. Let that start frying away um, with some onion and sweet peppers. Um, I'll put all of that in the pan at the same time with some olive oil. Let that all start frying off. And then I add a few tomatoes. Let that Because I'll put the tomatoes in last because the tomatoes fry a lot quicker than the rest of the stuff. So I'll put that in last and then I fry all of it all together. Just let it go nice and crispy. And then I put it in the oven just to keep it warm until I'm ready to put the cabbage on. This is the only thing that makes it not vegan, I think. I'm gonna go with Maggie. Can you see Maggie? Yeah, focus, Maggie. Come on, now. let's do that thing that everybody else does. Come on. No, <laughs> whatever, man. Just a vegetable stock, you basically. But I'm going with Maggie. I'm going in with Maggie. Take that big old stalk out the middle. Turn it over. Okay, and at this point, there's not really that much left to do. Um, at the point, I'm chopping the cabbage, and then I'm going to wash it, leave it in my bowl until I'm ready for it. I ended up swapping pans because that pan I'm using got a bit small because, as I said, depends how much people you're cooking for. So I take it out the pan, um, put it in a tray and just put it in the oven for a little bit, as I said earlier. And then I put the cabbage um, in that pan because all that flavour at the bottom where it's the sausage is stuck and kind of had that burny, sticky flavour onto it, I want all of that out. So I'm going to end up 
taking all that out and then putting the cabbage in the pan a little bit of water and then sauteing that down for about five minutes and then adding it all into one pan and stirring it together so yeah just enjoy the rest of the video guys and i will speak to you soon remember to like share subscribe and just holla at your girl say hi oh yeah ladies and gents and i also forgot to say me messing around with those mushrooms that you just saw me put in the air fryer got nothing to do with the uh meal i'm cooking it was just a mushroom for the kids i was just showing y'all i was putting some mushrooms in the air fryer it had nothing to do with the meal you can use them as a side dish if you want to because they're really nice on the side of the plate but i just stuck some mushrooms in the air fryer that's all i did because i like them and they're good and the babies love them too so yeah it's got nothing to do with what we're doing here anyway as i said guys enjoy the rest of the video and i'll speak to y'all soon so what I want to do is add a tiny bit of cayenne pepper, just a little bit because i got kids to feed, so a little bit of cayenne pepper, a little bit of onion powder, a bit of garlic powder which is not as garlic granules which is really naughty stuff but I'm using a little bit today. Just fried a bit of plantain. That's all I've done without you. I've done nothing else. I have took the cabbage off the stove. Um, it's nice and bit of a fish. You get a little peek. It's nice and al dente. Just, 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 you know, just took it off the stove. And now I'm going to take, I'm going to assemble, kind of. I'm going to just get my sausages back. I just bung them in the oven. Why 
Why you looking like you want to bury me?